Hi, today I'm going to show you how to add a button in Proloquo to go on an iPod Touch. A little bit different than on the iPad, um, but generally has the same features. It's just how you get there is a little bit differently, a little different. Um, so if you open up Proloquo, you'll see that you can't edit anywhere. There's nowhere to edit. So in order to turn on that options button, you have to go into your settings, go all the way down. So this is the settings part. You scroll all the way down to um, Proloquo and then you show options button. So we're going to turn that on. And then when you open Proloquo, this little um, grid comes up. So when you click on the grid, um, you can either close it or there's the options button. So I had already, it, usually it'll open up to this main page where you can see like your user um, appearances where you would do all of your changing of the backgrounds and things like that. Um, but we want to go to edit. Um, sorry, we want to go to restrictions and then click on edit mode. So now we're going to be able to go in and change things. So now you see the little pencil. Once you, um, so this is going to give you the features of being able to add a button. So go open up wherever you want to add a button. Say you want to add tea to your drinks. So you come over to the pencil and then there's a little plus. So you click on the plus and then you just say you want to add a button. Um, and then you just type in what you want as far as your word tea. So do we want a tea bag? Do you want a tea? bag a cup of tea. Um, they have lots of options there. So I'm just going to stick with the first one. Um, you can also go in if you want, click the picture and then choose, go to choose a picture. Um, and then you have a camera roll. So you can select from your camera roll if that's something that you wanted to do. Um, we do that a lot. Like if we have faces like people um, or things like that, and you can customize it that way. Or if there's a particular type of tea that your um, child or um, likes, you can take a picture of it and add it there. Um, and then just click done and then it'll say T. I want T. Um, and that's it. And then just to make sure that when you go back, you go into your options, you turn it off, and then you go back to your settings and you turn your um, show buttons option, um, show options button off. Um, so your child can't go in and mess anything else up. Anyway, that's it. Um, I just wanted to show you how to add a button on um, Proloquo to go on the iPod Touch.